hi guys and welcome back to my channel my name is ifi artistry if this is your first time seeing my video you are highly welcome and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for always watching my videos okay guys so in today's video i'm going to be teaching you how i achieve this beautiful brows so i'm going to be starting with my brow tema or like this is a wax stick actually so i'm going to be using that to tame down the hairs of her brows um okay guys so um before you begin to like draw your brows or anything first of all you have to carve the brows hairs like you have to carve the brow hairs right so when you are carving the brows you are going to make sure you trim them in a way that is going to be simple and easy for you to now draw so like for me like when i'm carving the brows i tends to like put the hairs in a way that when i start drawing it is not going to be a problem for me i'll just like i'll just follow the natural her hairs and just you know like make the outline and i'm good okay guys so i'm going to after taming down the hairs of the brows her hairs i just use my setting powder to set it you know like basically to remove um uh oil excess oil from the brows and all that okay guys so when i was done i'm going to be outlining the brows so i'm going to be using the Hage and esther brow gel H and e their brow gel so in the shade nubia n-u-b-i-a yeah i don't know why i'm spelling it i could have been writing it anyway okay guys so i'm going to be using that shade to outline the brows so i'm equally using this pens uh, this um angled brush from merak cosmetics um it's a flat brush so i'm using that to outline the brows okay guys so like i said uh, uh, initially in the beginning of the video so however i carved the brows that is the the way i'm going to just outline it so i'm just following her natural lashes her natural brows the hairs you know like i'm just drawing within that space and i'm just making the outline within it so that's why sometimes if i'm not the one that uh, um carved the brows initially or probably the carvings are not the same thing for any reason or something they most of the times affect my brows because i don't know i have built my mind in this way that i just follow the hairs of the brows and outline it you know i don't know if you understand even though at the, at the end of the day i might be trying to adjust and all that but yeah the only thing i can now do later is just to adjust and all that but normally i just follow the hairs and just you know outline it and i'm good okay guys so when i'm done i just use my pencil david's pencil to fill, fill out the brows i'm using david's pencil in the shade 003 so I'm, i think that shade is actually perfect for her she's not too light she's not dark like do you understand me the davis is perfect the perfect color for her body so yeah the davis pencil in the shade 003 yeah i use that for everybody most of the times but i think it's good on my clients okay guys so i go ahead and fill out you know and the filling out I'm, I'm just creating like light light strokes and you can see how penciled and how precise how sharpened and how precise my brush is right uh how precise my pencil is i think i'm actually beginning to feel sleepy <laughs> because like the time right now is 3 a.m in the morning so guys don't mind me okay guys so <laughs> when i'm done after uh, filling out the hair the brows and all that so i begin to conceal so i'm going to be concealing the brows with uh, this concealer from nuban beauty and my angled brush is from steel merak cosmetics i use the uh, flat brush to conceal the brows and this concealer is from nuban beauty like i said in the shade um the shade oh, 041 yeah 041 is a very light shade and the shade is equally thick i've equally said it in some of my videos that the reason why i prefer to use this particular i just recently began to use this if you have been watching my videos you'll know that i use um what is it called young um zika cosmetics conceal brows but i recently began to use this young and uh, nuban beauty and the reason is because um is is thick and uh it has this coverage like you just have this thickness that make brows cute 
I don't know how to explain that, but that is what it is. And I just love the thickness. I mean, like that particular shade. Yeah, that's 041 in particular. Like I would rather just mix it with another shade to just get another person's shade. But like, yeah, I just prefer using it to conceal brows recently these days. And yeah, once I'm done concealing the brows, there's this smoothness that it gives to that brows that makes me love it the more okay guys so after that I'm, I'm equally considering the second part of the brows and um in the beginning of the brows i go in with something darker than the first shade i'm using on the brow bone yeah it, like the two tips and all that so when i'm done i'm going to still use my brush to you know like blend it together blending guys like just like smudging out and blending it together like it's so important that you do this because like when i said this particular concealer is very thick if you leave it there one minute come back you can no longer blend it like it's that thick so do not even even me that is even blending it immediately still you can see that it's not even blending as smooth as had it been is a concealer that has no like too much that is not too thick it would have blended so easily and all that okay guys so i'm just concealing the upper part of the brows as well i'm using i think i'm using younger beauty no uh, sorry zika cosmetics because i cannot so sorry guys like i'm just i'm just <laughs> what i'm saying i don't really know but i really need to do this verse over and upload this video this night because <laughs> Okay, guys, so don't mind me anyway. So after that, I just, you know, like begin to set the brows. I'm done with uh, concealing the brows. I just concealed the upper part of the brows with um, ZK Cosmetics concealer. And um, I'm just like setting the upper part of the brows. I'm just setting the brow bone now with my powders. And uh, so I'm going to set the brow bone with, you know, a lighter shade of powder and then beginning of the brows with a darker shade, darker shade of powder. And that is it. So after setting it, you know that everything is ready. It's ready for you to like go into the next day for your makeup and all that. And guys, like after everything, of course, I look at this and you know, like that brow bone, like how sharp the brow bone is. I think that's one of the reasons why I really love this new concealer. And guys, look at the brows. Like, it's neat. It's neat. There is no anything. Yeah, it's very neat. Okay, guys, please do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Put on your post notification. Like and share my videos. I love you guys. I'll see you next time.